What's going on guys? So, as I mentioned, I am in Chicago and uh, having an amazing time with some old friends and would be remiss not to take a second and share something with you uh, that I think is going to be helpful to you. Overhead fix. That will be your luggage at the wheel. Look at the shirt! Uh, it uh, helps with the sound, so oh, yeah. the wind. Yeah. I don't know what's going on with that that whole thing, but. My, my career, my projection over the past four years has been like that, right? It's been trials and tribulations and ups and downs and I've learned a lot. There are particular things I've learned that have changed uh, the scope of what I do and how I do it. And I wanna share that with you so that, uh, you know, that line for you is less like a snake and more direct. And so these past two months in particular have been incredible. I've been fully immersed in, in what I'm doing. I've been energized, I've been enthusiastic, I'm putting out more, creating more, producing more than I ever have. All right, so I'm in my grandmother's basement visiting and uh, said I was gonna put speeches out on Monday. It's Monday, so I uh, gotta make this happen. We're finding a, a rhythm for the verse right now. And I realized it was kind of a light bulb moment recently. I put out a video last week, and like I said in the vlog, I was traveling, right? I wouldn't have, didn't have a lot of time for like production or, you know, there's no budget, there was nothing like that. I just wanted to create a video. I had, you know, the, the audio content, and so I thought, let's use what we have. You know, and I called my brother from down the street, he held my camera, we made this video, we produced it, we didn't, you know, storyboard or script or any of it. Just did it all in my apartment. And then maybe some stuff outside. Yeah. Here we go. Oh, they fixed it. We filmed the video for Lost You in my apartment and on the balcony. Uh, pretty low key. Not much to it. And uh, super proud of it. And I think. Uh, the takeaway here is that, you know, you have every single thing you need. If you're looking to make some art, just go out and do it, no exceptions. And I grabbed the footage and I came to, you know, Massachusetts, I'm sitting there with my family, I'm editing it. And I was like, you know, you've arrived. Like my whole thing has been fighting this progress versus perfection. You know, I've been working towards that for a long time and I feel like I'm there. I feel like I've, I've fully emotionally detached from the work that I put out, right? The criticism, the feedback, how it does. I mean, there's there's some anticipation when you spend all this time and energy on something and you, and you, you know, put it into the universe. And the perspective has shifted now, or shifted now to the point where it's like, you don't see it as a reflection of you and your skill set in the moment. It's all it's worth, its value, its purpose is to get you to the next level. So when you think of it like that, right, I know there's a lot of creators, there's a lot of authors, a lot of entrepreneurs, a lot of athletes, a lot of people out there watching this that, that do some great work. And what I want you to do is, is understand that that work is, is, is not a permanent reflection of you. It's what you need to do to get to the next step, the next level so that you can become better. And I think when you've really capitalized on that, when you understand that fully, you're free, you're liberated. It's, it's an amazing thing. All right, so we are outside of uh, the bar that Chris is playing at. He's uh, here with his band and gonna show some love and go say hi and uh, watch him play a show. So it should be awesome. I know like there's these sort of stories that we write like we don't have what we need or you know the time right now is not perfect things aren't great I'm not ready 
and I want that to be a thing of the past for you because there's always something to do right now. And that little momentum, whatever you can do in the moment creates the next step and the next step and the, you know, the, the, the whole snowflake becomes an avalanche type thing. So find your snowflake, find what works for you, find the right now and just put it in motion. Um, because that's going to unlock a lot of doors. It's going to keep you feeling good, energized, refreshed, um, and, and you know, keep your perspective right. You know, you'll value the right things and you'll grow. So, wanted to take a second and share that with you. Uh, have an amazing week, and uh, we'll be back tomorrow with another video. So, take care.